Why are you paying for ChatGPT when you can run your own LLM completely for free? You don't need an API key, you don't need the cloud, all you need is your computer. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can run your very own LLM locally on your computer with a ChatGPT style interface. So to run this LLM locally, we're gonna be using the new generation of OpenAI models, which is the GPT OSS models. Now, as you may have heard, they released two different models, a 20 billion parameter model and a 120 billion parameter model. To keep things simple for this demo, we're gonna be using the 20 billion parameter model, which is really good for use cases on devices, and the 120 billion parameter model obviously has much larger complexity, has a much higher reasoning power, and is better for production grade use cases if you have things like GPUs available. But we're not gonna worry about any of the infrastructure to actually run this because we have a really clever way of running this LLM locally on our computer without hardly any setup or configuration at all. So what we're gonna be using is the Olama framework. So Olama is a partner of OpenAI and they make it super easy to deploy open weights models on your own computers or on your own servers. Now I've already downloaded this tool, but to follow along, all you need to do is come to this website, click on download and download it for the respective operating system that you're using. Then once you've done that, you can open up a terminal window. Olama should have been installed. So for example, if I type in the Olama command, it will come up with a whole bunch of helper commands that I can use. But for now, what I'm gonna do is I need to pull the GPT OSS 20 billion parameter model onto my computer. So I'm essentially downloading this model onto my computer. Now I've already downloaded this model, so it should be fairly quick, but if this is the first time that you're doing it, it might take a little bit of time to download. Great, so you can see that was done pretty much instantly, which is fine. Now that that's downloaded, the next thing to do is literally to open up Olama and to start using the LLM. So I'm gonna search for the Olama application, I'm gonna open this up, and I'm gonna make this full screen as well. So the first thing that you notice is that this looks very similar to ChatGPT. This interface, this Olama application, has been built to be really simple and intuitive. And naturally, in the world of software, it's good to have something that is similar to what people are already used to. So the fact that it does look and feel like ChatGPT is kind of a good thing because we know how to use it straight away. First thing to recognize, if I come up into the top left-hand corner, I've got two options here. I've got this sort of like sidebar, which includes all the different conversations that I'll be able to have and track, which is very ChatGPT style. I've got a whole bunch of settings that I can tune here as well. Uh, so where the model is located, context length, uh, airplane mode, this is really cool. So you can actually keep all the data local and you can even sign into your Olama account as well. And on top of that, you just have this new chat mode essentially, which you know is pretty standard. But then if I come over into the text input, I have a few options here. So if I'm signed in, I can enable web search, which will allow it to do more sort of like deep research style uh, executions. I can enable turbo mode as well, but for the focus of this video, I wanna be able to select the model. And as you can see, the GPT OSS 20 billion parameter model has automatically been selected, which is what I do want to use. But before I start using it, I'm just gonna show you some of the other options that we have available. So we have a whole host of different open weights models that we can use here. Once again, you'll have to download these models locally to your computer, so you might not necessarily want to use all of these, but you can use the DeepSeek model, you can use Gemma, you can use Quen, you can use the larger OSS model as well, or you can find other models online too. So this is incredible, you've got all these different models at, at your fingertips essentially. So let's start with a query. Uh, let's ask it to explain what chain of thought reasoning is. Now, of course, because we're running this locally and because we're leveraging the Olama servers as well and the Olama platform, it's not necessarily going to be as fast, as lightning fast as what you'd expect in the ChatGPT interface. If you were to run this locally or even host your own version of the GPT OSS model on a GPU accelerated hardware, then yes, you could expect performance which would be comparable. But if you're not necessarily in a rush and if privacy and cost is really important to you, then this is a massively valuable asset to have. To be able to have a chat GPT style tool at your fingertips costing absolutely nothing is a game changer. So you can see here, it went through the thinking process. We can actually expand this out to see exactly what it was thinking about. And as you'd expect, it's outputting and streaming all the response as I'd expect in chat GPT. This is amazing. Now, obviously, depending on the length of the response, obviously it's gonna take longer to, to generate, but Considering that I'm not paying for this model, for internal use cases or for examples where privacy is really important, this is a, a great alternative. 
You can see it's outputting everything is marked down as expected within ChatGPT as well. And it's providing a, a really comprehensive answer to be fair. So I guess one thing that is interesting with this is that with new generation open weights models, such as the GPT OSS models, or even the DeepSeq models, this is a really nice way of testing these models really quickly and evaluating them for your own use cases. So for example, you could use a service like this using Olama to simply just test and start to evaluate whether or not these open weights models might be of use to you. And then if they are, then you could perhaps transition away from an Olama hosted service like this to your own privately hosted version of that open weights model. And you could even fine tune and retrain it yourself as well. So I think tools like this, alongside the open weights models, provide a really interesting space in the market of AI. Not only does it allow you to get up and running with these open weights models really quickly, you can start evaluating them, using them for your own use cases. And then if you are happy with them, you can go ahead and deploy them and fine tune them yourself. It's almost like a try before you buy kind of scenario. That's how I look at it. And then, as I said earlier, of course, if you did want to deploy this privately and just use this as your main LLM rather than paying for a third party service, then why not? That's even better. So that's how you can deploy and run some of the world leading state of the art LLM models locally on your computer within just a few minutes. This opens up so many possibilities and genuinely is a game changer. If this helped you, don't forget to like, subscribe and let me know in the comments if you're going to be running LLMs locally on your computer. Apart from that, I'll see you soon.